Can you share your screen? Yeah, one second. Okay, once you get into eBay, okay, it's going to look like this. All you got to do to get anywhere in my account is click this says it says my eBay. Just click it. Okay. Okay. Now you're going to be in my store. Okay. This is the selling manager. Okay. You're going to go to um, active underneath selling manager. Active. And you're pretty much going to just select this right here, and that'll select everything. And then you'll push the drop down edit. Mm -hmm. This will allow you to edit everything all at once. Not at one time, but like one by one, but very easily. Um, you'll highlight everything here, then you'll click this edit fields. Okay. Maybe not. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so good try. Another image. Well, sometimes they let you do it really fast, like. Um, but anyway, you can do this and edit. Just click on the link okay. and you'll go to the listing. It says revise your item right here. You just click on that. Then you're going to scroll down. I like to keep my cursor on the right when I do this because there's so much stuff on the left. You'll kind of get trapped in this stuff. But if you scroll down to the right, you get a lot smoother. Then you can go here and you go. Oh. Then you can just pretty much make sure. I mean, you're pretty familiar with the site. So you just pull, you're just going to go add edit photos and you're just going to go and click off the photos and then you're going to upload the new ones and you can upload several at a time. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, buddy. Yes. Just make sure, mm -hmm. just make sure this title and another thing right here. This right here, once you once you get into the little thing, there's a template. Okay, when you roll when you scroll down, about halfway through the template, it's going to say features. Okay. Then you can kind of look at the actual model. And you can like see the description. It's got dual six nine speaker holes, no speakers. Okay, so this is actually very deceptive. Okay, so I don't want you to put speakers up. I just want you to put the raw. Like this should not be up here. Um, this one should not be up here. This one should not be up here. This one should not be up here. So make sure that you're taking an extra few minutes to read the description and know this right here, it shows perfectly that there's no speakers. This is the, this is the back, this is the front, and then this is, uh, I mean, this is, this is the front, this is the front, and this is the back with, uh, without the speakers. And make sure okay. you're re replacing these uh, correct ones. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, cool. So after that, all you got to do is click save or click continue down at the bottom. It's going to ask you to promote and review your listing. There, there's always some sort of a warning here. Don't worry about that. It's just you know reiterating some policies. And then click Submit Revisions, and then you're good to go.
You got any questions on that? Um, about the module name, is it similar on the, the website that, I, that I'm working? Yeah, it's exactly the same. It's this exact okay. heading. Everything's the same. Okay. Also, we've tied a SKU in, the same SKU number. Mm. Oh, that's... Uh, you know what? I'm in the wrong account. <laughs> But the I gave you the correct uh, I gave you the correct information. So all you got to do is is we're in uh, the exotic account. This is the project for next week. Yeah, you can probably you can probably do this in a day though. If you I mean if you can take an hour and do it today, you know just to get a head start that'd be cool. But all you got to do is come in here. This is the correct account. You're going to go to active. You're going to find the items. You're just going to select revise. And then you're going to, right here, you're going to take this out and then you're going to add a new item. Okay. Click continue and then continue again, then you're done. Mm -hmm.